And on another note. Well, summer has ended. Have you all seen, but for sure you all have. Especially if you follow motor vloggers and shit. The new uh, GoPro Karma's out. What's a Karma for those who don't know? It's a drone made by GoPro. Jesus. Anywho, um, that drone comes with a uh, gimbal holder and shit. It actually has one for. It's integrated into the drone. You can move it from the drone and place it on the handle so you can, you know, be on hands without the drone and shit. Looks really nice. Very sleek. The size of the drone looks awesome too. But, I don't know. For the price, there's, compared to the uh, DJI and shit, yeah, kind of like does look good, but I don't know. You got the uh, the drone for seven ninety nine, but you had to buy the camera separately. So, for example, me that I wear that I use uh, the Hero Three Plus Silver Edition, I'm screwed. <laughs> There's no use for my camera anymore because it's obsolete on this drone. And I think it's fucked up that it, that shit's happening. That you have to have a uh, Hero 4 or the new Hero GoPro 5 in order to uh, be able to use the drone features and shit. And I don't know, you could walk on your hands. It's a nice little toy. I mean, with the uh, what is it? The session you get it for like nine ninety nine, and and for the Hero Five it's like ten ninety nine. I think it's fucked up. I mean, why do you have to buy the camera separately? I'll be posting the uh, specs down in the description for the uh, what's been provided by. Uh, GoPro for the Karma, the new Session 5, and the GoPro Hero 5. Uh, I kind of like it, but I'm still like doubtful. I mean, it's features as far as what they've been showing. It's very user-friendly. I'm not much convinced. I mean, it's fucking expensive, man. Here in Mexico, the fucking peso value has dropped a lot. 
I mean, I'm paying like almost twice as much for a product I used to pay full pesos for uh, a few years back. So it passes to the dollar. So it's like, if I'm buying something, it's gotta be something that is gonna last me quite some time, and and it's not gonna fail. I gotta check that everything's working good. I mean, these GoPros have been working well for me, but I don't know. And on another note, well, summer has ended. We are officially in fall. Doesn't look like it here in Guadalajara. A few minutes ago it was fucking chilly as hell and right now it's fucking hot as hell. And I maybe like moved a few miles. I got myself all fucking wet. Hey there, sexy. But yeah. I mean, as far as motovlogger wise, to use these cameras, the, uh, What you might call it, the um, the Cena. It's not going to be operational anymore. I mean, they completely killed this, these guys. They have their own cameras and all. But as far as integration with GoPro, sharing technologies and shit, being able to connect your GoPro to the backpack, Cena backpack, and be able to record the audio, I don't think it's going to be possible anymore. That blows. Vloggers are going to have to uh, think of another way of recording and maybe, I don't know, record it off a recording device, audio recording device, or off of the mobile. Who knows? I mean, it's not the end of the world for the uh, motor vloggers, but. Uh, They're making it a little bit difficult as far as uh, motoblogging technology compatible wise shit. Me no likey. Me no likey one bit. So that's it for me, guys. I mean, I don't know what you think about the GoPros.